Welcome to In Focus with Silvana Pavlovska. Today is the 11th of March, 2023. Today, I'd like to start a series of um, sessions or recordings whereby we're going to learn something about the Macedonian question a historical overview. In fact, that is the name of the academic paper written by Dr. Ivanka Vasilevska. Dr. Ivanka Vasilevska is a, has a PhD. She is an associate professor at the Cyril and Methodius University in Skopje, Eustinius, Primus Law Faculty in the Republic of Macedonia. The paper titled The Macedonian Question, a historical overview. And it starts off with Ante Popovsky's statement, which reads, there it is, that simple land of seizures and expectations that taught the stars to whisper in Macedonian, but nobody knows it. In the second half of the 19th century, on the Balkan political stage, the Macedonian question was separated as a special phase from the great Eastern question. Without the serious support by the Western powers, and without Macedonian millet in the borders of the empire, this question became a real Gordian knot in which, until the present times, will entangle and leave their impact the irredentist aspirations for domination over Macedonia and its population by the Balkan countries, Greece, Bulgaria, and Serbia. The consequence of the Balkan Wars and the World War I was the territorial dividing of ethnic Macedonia. After the collapse of the Ottoman Empire, the territory of Macedonia was divided among Serbia, Greece, and Bulgaria, an act of the Balkan countries which, instead of being sanctioned, has received an approval with the confirmation of their legitimacy made with the treaties introduced by the Varsay word order, world order. Divided with the state borders after 1919, the Macedonian nation was submitted to a severe economic exploitation political deprivation, national non-recognition, and oppression, with a final goal to be ethnically liquidated. In essence, the Macedonian question was not recognized as an ethnic problem because the conditions from the past and the powerful propaganda machines of the three neighboring countries Serbia, Greece, and Bulgaria, made the efforts to make the impression before the world public that the Macedonian ethnicity did not exist. While Macedonia was mainly treated as a geographical term and the, the ethnic origin of the population on the Macedonian territory was considered exclusively as a lost heard, in quotations, lost heard. That is, as a nation which is either Serbian, Greek, or Bulgarian. On the account of this situation, during the entire period between the wars, the Serbs, Greeks, and the Bulgarians were unified around the position through which they denied the existence of the separate Macedonian identity. 
Serbia named Macedonia in the Vardar part South Serbs. Bulgaria claimed that the Macedonians were nothing else but purely Bulgarian people. And Greece entitled the Macedonians to be Slavophonic Greeks before finally giving them the name Bulgarians. The Macedonian question fell under the shadow of the oblivion by the great European powers, which were the creators and signers of the aforementioned international treaties. In this condition, the Macedonian question patiently waited for the next chance to be reactualized until the Asnon held on the 2nd of August, 1944. It was exactly then when, where the statementship vision, which the Macedonian people carried throughout all the changes and destiny's temptations, got its expressive form with the creation of federal Macedonia within the borders of Avnoi, Yugoslavia. In the second half of the 19th century, on the Balkan political stage, the Macedonian question was separated as a special phase from the Great Eastern Question. Although this question alone seemed minor compared to the Eastern question, it was signified by the specific structure of the population, the geographical connections, the development of the trade and the historical and cultural heritage. Since its beginning, this national question was met by the territorial aspirations of the Balkan neighbors, as well as by the position of the great powers aiming, aiming to maintain the status quo within the Ottoman Empire. For these reasons, the Macedonian question since its emergence, undoubtedly it was largely related to the Turkish question. In the following historical decades to the present days, it evolved, transformed, and at certain moments disappeared and emerged again, always under the lucid monitoring of the Balkan state entities which were formed during the 19th century. Without the serious support by the Western powers and without Macedonian millet in the borders of the empire, this question became a real Gordian knot in which, until the present times, will entangle and leave the impact, the irredentist aspirations for domination over Macedonia and its population by the Balkan countries, Greece, Bulgaria, and Serbia. Therefore, knowing the historical development upon which the Balkan nation states were created during the 19th century, and at the beginning of the 20th century, we can freely conclude that on the Balkan Peninsula, the states were created first and the nations afterwards. In a general overview, it is nearly impossible to give a complete chronological review of the Macedonian question. Therefore, the overall picture for the opening of this question can be explained from several different aspects. First of all, within the administrative arrangement of the Ottoman Empire, Macedonia did not exist as a separate administrative unit. The geographical territorial unit Macedonia in essence included the vilayets of Kosovo, Skopje, Manastir and Salonika. This geographical unit, which belonged to the European part of the great Ottoman Empire, led directly to the Straits and thankfully to the Vardar Valley through the peninsula's backside ex exited directly to the Mediterranean Sea. The term Macedonia in the 19th century was used solely as a geographical region 
The people who lived in this region were equated with the Greeks, Serbs, Bulgarians, and the Albanians. During the conference in Constantinople in 1876, and on the Berlin Congress in 1878, the representatives of the great powers considered that the region had very mixed ethnic composition in which the Bulgarians dominated. It was believed that the second main pretender is Greece, while Serbia held the weak third place. Since the beginning of the state's establishment of Bulgaria, Greece and Serbia, the Macedonian question in the national agendas on the Balkan Peninsula represented an actual apple of discord. Firstly, there were um, agendas on the Balkan Peninsula represented an actual apple of discord. Firstly, they were calling upon the orthodox element, which dominated among the population in Macedonia, and through it, they defined the population's identity. The initializing of the term Macedonia, salad, un uh, salad Macedoni, demonstrates how the history and the identity were intertwined, inter with the activities of the Orthodox Church, which, through the influence of their, <clears throat> bear with me, please, their own centers incited the interests of the local populations, entangling them all together with the issues of the ethnic background and the national identity. The second very important feature which conditioned the Macedonian question at the beginning of its opening can be found in the determination of the structure of the population in the region Macedonia within the Ottoman Empire, as well as by the activities which occupied this population at the time. In the 19th century and at the beginning of the 20th century, the structure of the population in Macedonia was in the biggest um, amount rural. 80% of the population was tied to the agrarian relations and therefore the main concern of this population was regarding the bare existence. Connected to the structure of the population, the next important factor was the question of the church. Until 1870, the main pretender also on the national plan for the Macedonian population was Greece, led by the Patriarchate of Constantinople. Within the forming of the Bulgarian ex Exarchate in 1870 was also carried out the division of the same population on the confessional plan. With the emergence of the Serbian and a bit later of the Romanian propaganda, the propaganda battles of the Balkan monarchies for supremacy over the territory of the Ottoman possession in this territory generally had crashed over the varieties of the ethnic, religious, political, and ideological rainbows of the population of Macedonia. Starting from the period of the Eastern crisis, that is 1875 to 1878, until the formation of the Macedonian Liberation Movement in 1893, the Macedonian question has received a greater actualization. The Eastern question certainly pointed out to the Macedonian question as well, which especially after the outbreak of the Bosnian Herzegovinian uprising from 1875 got its unique kind of expression. Mainly, this can be observed through the Razlotsi insurrection in 1876, whose main platform was consisted in the struggle against the Turkish authority, the connecting with the resistance of the other Balkan peoples, and most directly to the Bosnian Herzegovina uprising and the liberation of Macedonia. Further on, on the same, uh, the same can be said also through the main goals of the Macedonian Kresna uprising from 1878. Their goals were eradicate, uh, to eradicate the feudal Ottoman system 
demanding equality for all the citizens before the laws of the liberated Macedonian country, regardless of the nationality and religion, the collaboration and mutual activities with the neighboring Balkan countries, as well as to collaborate with the Albanian revolutionary movement. Despite these unsuccessful attempts, their influence had reflected not only on the perception of the local Ottoman authorities, but also on the diplomatic correspondence of the great European powers, which noted it and started to follow the cent uh, centrifugally smothered local uprisings in Macedonia. As a result, to the strong pressure by the great powers over the Ottoman Empire, in the spring of 1880, the empire started to prepare a constitution project to reform the vilayets in the European part of the Ottoman Empire. This reformation undertaking, uh, this reformation undertaking resulted from Article 23 of the Berlin Treaty and was supposed to reflect the liberal tendencies for inclusion of the non-Muslim population within the local administration. Considering the favorable conditions and the attention of the great powers towards the reformation process in the empire, at the same time, two institutions addressed them in the name of the Macedonian movement, demanding political and national autonomy of Macedonia. Those were the Macedonian League and the National Assembly of Macedonia, called Edinstvo or unity in English. The genesis of the Macedonian National Revolutionary Movement represented the era which officially started on the 23rd of October, 1893. This historic act distinguishes and compiles two uh, turning points of the Macedonian revolutionary history, which had an essential influence over the development of the Macedonian question, and at the same time over the entire Balkan diplomatic behavior between the two world wars. The several decades of the Macedonian national revolutionary movement struggle had the idea to establish an autonomous, independent and sovereign country, Macedonia as its final goal. I think we shall end the first part of this new um, podcast or recordings, which relate to an academic paper titled The Macedonian Question, a historical overview written by Dr. Ivanka Vasilevska, PhD, an associate professor from St. Cyril and Methodius University in Skopje, the Justinius Primus Law Faculty in the Republic of Macedonia. The second part will follow after this part until we finish covering this academic paper by this academic and actual Macedonian background person rather than someone from Western world countries with their own views and assumptions and conclusions about the Macedonian question. So thank you for listening to me. Um, um, this is uh, In Focus, a program dedicated to information, debates, and the truth. I shall see you very soon. Thank you indeed.